If there's two things I hate more than anything else, it's the less fortunate and political TikToks. Okay guys, what's up and welcome back to a brand new camera angle on the channel. When I'm standing up and looking at the camera right here, the, the quality seems to be shit, so I just decided this angle pretty sick, pretty rad if you know what I mean, right? So let's hop into the video. You guys caught me, okay? I've been using TikTok recently, okay? And it's one, giving me absolute goddamn super aids, and two, it's made me discover a newfound passionate hatred for teenagers who try to talk politics, right? You know, I'm scrolling through my For You page, and I just see, I just see, like, a 15-year-old white girl saying, like, capitalize off pain, put a stick to your brain, and, like, throwing up some, like, BLM, abortion, gang, right? And it's like, oh, no, you just, you look like a retard, bro. You look like an absolute retard. And I kind of just want to make a video on this. I kind of just want to make a video actually, like, talking about these people and reacting to some of their TikToks, right? Now, this isn't going to be me going, oh, look at what they're doing. What they're doing is so stupid. No, I'm going to be looking at what they're actually saying. Like, if they're saying, oh, abortion is murder, blah, blah, blah. I'm gonna be actually like counteracting their statement just to like show them how like low level their brain is right and Exposing them and telling them that they need to hop off the political scene because they are smooth brains All right, every single political tiktoker is such a smooth brain. It's absolutely insane. All right, let's check out the first one Second on my copyright Mother dick, mother dick, mother, 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 fucking pricks running the industry. I don't like copyright, so I pulled up. See, the funny thing is, on this one, I'm actually gonna, like, criticize what he's doing and not what he's saying. Because, like, the things that he's saying, we're gonna get to in the later in the video but it's just the sheer fact of like look how base level what you're saying is yeah capitalize off pain don't vote joe biden capitalize off pain put a to your brain blm finger my butthole it's like these aren't even like meaningful to you anymore these are just like you're just throwing them up to have like anti-blm attached th to your name you're not even knowing what anything's actually about you're not even digging into anything you're just like yeah guys fuck blm dude fuck that shit dude like, it, you're turning politics, something with meaning and something that affects everybody, into just, like, these, like, Call of Duty clan tags, like, Yeah, fuck BLM, don't vote for Joe Biden. Like, th I see this all the time happening with teenagers, where they'll go, like, pull Biden signs out of the street, right? It's like, oh, you, like, you really think, like, you're, like, doing something. Like, you really think you're doing something, bro. You're retarded. You actually look so dumb. You don't realize how, like, base level your fucking political IQ is, all right? And that's not me over here sounding like, you know, I'm trying to fucking take over the world with my genius. I'm just saying that these people are dumb. Not saying I'm smart. These people are dumb, okay? Let's hop on to the next one. Copyright. Copyright. Kind of fucking sucks. Put up with your bitch and she copyright a look. Copyright look, uh, uh, copyright look, uh, copyright is balls and it blah 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 balls. Okay, like on this one, I'll I'll actually you know counteract what she's saying. Basically, the statement that she's making is in the hospitals, they you know when a girl or a boy is born out of the mother's womb, they say oh it's a boy, oh it's a girl. They never say non-binary, therefore it's not fucking real. What? That's the dumbest shit I've ever heard. Um. Any, any person that claims non-binary is an actual gender is obviously lying if they're talking in a biological sense, but I don't see the problem with having someone, you know, identify as non-binary. What's the pro- like, what, what, what's really the problem, right? It's like, they don't feel as if they're a man or a woman, so socially, you know, we should be able to accept this, right? And this person's just going, nope, nope, you're definitely, you're definitely a man. You're definitely a man, bro. I, I'm, I'm catching you flipping dude you're definitely a man okay and it's like oh damn really dude fucking thanks thanks i'm a man thanks bro fucking helpful advice dude when you know they really do know that biologically they're a man but you know they want to play this social game and when i say play this social game i don't mean to be condescending because i have no problem with calling someone by their pronouns i have no problem with you know like you know playing into this like non-binary thing and conservatives who go yeah dude there's only two genders in case you didn't know new study just revealed everything the whole truth there's only two genders it's like yeah no no shit homie like oh you're so dumb black lives matter yeah they do 
You're including black police officers too, right? No, all cops are bad. Okay, um, what about the 1,000 black babies that are aborted every single day? No, they don't really matter. Okay, what about all the black business owners whose businesses were burned down and looted because of the riots? No, those were peaceful protests. Well, what about all the black women, babies, and men killed in all the riots? Mm-mm. What about black conservatives? Absolutely not. What about all the black children trafficked by Democratic elites? We don't bring that up. So, according to you, only some black lives matter. <laughs> You're so racist. Get educated. Now, baseline, I can see the point that she's making is like, you know, black people are fucked over in a lot more ways than police brutality in the criminal justice system. But Black Lives Matter is not an organization focused on, you know, child trafficking or abortion. It's an organization focused on police brutality and, you know, um, you know, criminal justice system and all that shit, right? So when you come out and say the, the name of your organization is everything you stand for the the name the literal name black lives matter no matter what the words are behind that name yeah those front page words are anything of substance about your organization right black lives matter isn't out here trying to like stop child trafficking right now i agree that well there are you know some other issues that maybe other organizations do need to focus on but when i see people out here going yeah dude black lives matter you're not really helping black lives like motherfucker do you know what black lives matter is for it's not for that it's for something else right copyright all i gotta say is copyright fucking sucks copyright trash bitch motherfucking duck put it with my now this is one that i just find to be like really really retarded right when people say bro you're under 18 stop caring about politics right it's the same thing it's the same exact thing when people go like bro you're a girl stop caring about basketball football right bro you're you're 12. Stop caring about the stock market, bro. Bro, you're this. Stop caring about this. It's like, dude, I, I don't, I'm not fitting into your label, all right? If I enjoy talking politics and I enjoy, you know, being in the political sphere or whatever, if I enjoy listening to destiny debates and I enjoy, you know, being fucking 20 times as intelligent as you, right? then I'm going to fucking do that. And I'm going to give my fucking opinion when some retard says some gay shit like this, all right? I see so many kids on uh, Snapchat doing this too, where they're like, bro, leave the politics to the adults, bro. Leave the politics to the adults. And then we'll go out and fucking like rob a goddamn Joe Biden sign out of someone's yard. It's like, what? Are you broken? Right? It's like, no, you're, you're actually retarded. Right? Plus, not to mention that this is something that directly affects our future, right? And to not, you know, get an early start, in my opinion, is retarded. I think it's way better for us to get an early start in learning about these things, too. Because people like you going, why the hell, why the fuck you care about politics, bro? You're, you're not 18 yet. Are going to be the same people wiping my goddamn ass. I, I need it. I need to crank it down a notch, bro. Fuck. Put it with my gang, we gon' copyright your ass. Put it with my gang, we gon' hit you in the grass. Put it with my gang, we copyright your- Okay, so basically this person's saying, if being gay is a choice, then being homophobic is a choice too? Well, yeah, I totally agree with you on that front. But it's way easier to restrain yourself from roasting a gay person for being gay than to actually, you know, exercise your sexuality as a gay person, right? It's way easier to just not roast someone than it is to, you know, forcibly make yourself straight, right? So it's like, yeah, they're both choices, but to conflate the two is just absolutely insane okay there's much more of an urge to you know go out and you know be gay if you are gay right then there is to like roast someone for being gay i mean who knows dude who knows maybe 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 whenever a gay person walks across the street you just want to fucking bring out the torches dude i that's that's you man in that case it's completely justified next talk what up with your bitch you are wear a copyright thong yo hey whoa hey yeah Got my copyright gun. Hey, we gonna pull up and strike. Hey, got my copyright bitch. <sighs> oh no. Oh no, dude. Oh no. <sighs> Where do I begin? Okay. So when um lefties, I guess, say 
my body, my choice, they're, you know, referring to the uh, fetus that's inside their stomach, right? When conservatives use this like rebuttal where they go oh, i thought it was my body my choice oh gotcha buddy oh get roasted oh dude they're they think they're all smooth right but it's like bro it, bro it's a piece of cloth as opposed to a fetus inside your body right now you could say well i do agree that you know the fetus has a much larger impact on someone's life than the piece of cloth but the piece of cloth arguably does have an impact on someone's life ignoring the enormous difference between the two there they are still comparable right and to that i would say okay you're right but why does a fetus before four weeks deserve moral consideration? Seriously, think about it. Why does a fetus before four weeks deserve moral consideration? Now, I personally wouldn't abort a baby after four weeks, but when she says, oh, you could kill an innocent person or whatever, right? You know, trying to cast liberals as hypocrites, right? You would have to think, right, who are you actually talking to? You're overgeneralizing the fuck out of liberals here when you go, all liberals, all liberals think that you should be able to, to uh, abort a baby at nine months, right? It's like, okay, okay, what about a person like me who thinks that you can only be able to abort a baby before four weeks, right? What about me? What do you have to say to me then, huh? Huh? What, what do you have to say, right? Because after the four weeks are up, the baby starts to develop characteristics that would give him or her the ability to experience pain, experience consciousness, and many other things. And that's when I think that the baby starts to become, you know, a person, right? Before the four weeks, I don't really think the baby can be considered a person, right? So actually, we're on the same page. We both think that the killing of innocent people is unjustified. Like, what do you have to say now, right? You can't just overgeneralize Democrats and liberals like this. You can't just say, oh, every Democrat thinks this. Every liberal thinks this. Every leftist thinks this. Lamau, right? It's really fucking gay. And there's so many more TikToks I could show you where right-wingers just and left-wingers just overgeneralize the fuck out of the other side. And it's just so annoying. It's just like actually the cringiest shit on the entire planet, okay? If you're like 15, okay, listen to some Destiny, listen to some Hassan, listen to some Ben Shapiro, dude, listen to some anything, anything at all but other TikTokers, bro. Get educated. No, I'm not actually gonna say that unironically, but like, Stop being retarded, okay? <laughs> Stop being retarded. Um, but anyways, guys, that's uh, that's gonna be it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you disagree with anything that I said, be sure to leave a comment. I could even get you in the Discord server and we could chat it out live, you know, over a voice call. I'd love to do that with any of you guys. But um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. No Steven for today. We'll bring him back next video probably. Peace, peace, and stay dank. Bye.